Graham Nash's bad day is about to get worse. Graham, I forgive you for failing. Much worse. His climb up the corporate ladder has been derailed. You didn't get it, Graham. You're not the one. No hard feelings about Bob getting the spot over you. I suppose if we were rival princes, I could just have you killed. Poor Graham decided to take destiny into his own hands and become the master of his own fate. Emperor. Emperor. He bags his wife. Mr. Marshall, I'm afraid we have some very bad news for you. <coughs> and finds a new love. Next, his boss must be permanently retired. Robert Benham died in that explosion. He was your superior, wasn't he? No, he was my boss. Graham Nash will stop at nothing to make it to the top. I believe the best man always wins in the end. I really mean it when I say be careful. Graham, you killed your wife, didn't you? We should get rid of anybody that doesn't put the company first. Now, Graham is living the American dream. Michael Caine, Elizabeth McGovern. In a film, sneak previews calls wicked, brilliant, and captivating. Oh, my God. What a shock. A film for anyone who's ever muttered, die, yuppie scum. A shock to the system. The thriller that proves killing is easy. Getting away with it is murder. <laughs>